Hi guys, welcome to Ditsy's Diamond Den. Or is it Shay's secret stash? I don't know. I'm wearing a hat today. I guess I'm impersonating Shay. Um, wearing the hat because trying to keep a, a little bit of dust out of my hair because we have been very busy completely redoing my craft room. It is a total remodel. We have changed out all the light fixtures and the little air things, all of it. And yeah, it is looking really, really good, really, really girly. The only thing that sucks is we moved everything out here into the living room. The living room is totally trashed right now. Um, hoping that I could diamond paint in the living room, but the lighting in here, we've got like special lighting in my craft room so I can see stuff a little bit better. And there is not enough lighting out here. So I have not diamond painted since last Thursday. I am, my puppies always look exhausted. They're old. They're 15 and 13 over here. And number 14 is laying over by Dear Helper. Yep. He's mine. Who do we have in here? I see a name in here. That Don't I you recognize. start all week. All week I've been listening to this. Don't you do it. I'm sorry. Koopa Kai is here. Uh, I see them. I see them and they had 85 degree weather today. I would love to have that humid or not. It was like 70 here maybe. Just I like the humidity. I loved it. I have asthma. And for some reason, when I lived in Georgia for a short while, my asthma was like non-existent in the humidity. It was awesome. It does make a huge mess and it is definitely going to be worth it. It is going to be very bright and very pink and I got all kinds of cool stuff for it. So we're super excited about doing it. So, but I have been... Uh, yeah, no diamond painting. It's been driving me a little bit crazy. And then, of course, as you guys know, when you're doing like these really big projects, you know, we're going between, no, do it this way. No, do it that way. Oh, I'm going to strangle you, you know, to that's so funny. Or we should do this. Or like anybody that follows me on Instagram saw the little note that we put um, oh, on the baseboard on the, or the floorboard on the subfloor. Yeah. 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 We are a little. Yeah. We're pretty tired. And then we worked so hard yesterday that I don't know what the hell we were thinking. So we work all day long. And then at like 10 o'clock at night, we're both like, I'm so hungry. So dear helper <laughs> offers to make us. And it's like mini pancakes, sausage, and scrambled eggs. Yeah, but and we like the spicy sausage. It, yeah, it was a super spicy sausage. It was, it was. Terrible. Yeah. Trying to sleep. So guess who had heartburn and kept waking up all night long? Both of us. Yeah. It's not awesome. Did you like that note, Tracy? We've had some storm and tornado warnings, but we're good now. It was delicious going down, but it was not as enjoyable when it kept coming up into the throat all night long. Yeah, Cause it was so late. We, we laid down almost directly after eating, which you're not supposed to do. Uh, and we, we were did. tired. We, we just, like, we ate and then put our plates down just on our nightstands and, like, fell asleep. <laughs> so. So if you said hi, everybody, like Sparkle and Drill and Gabriel, uh -huh. Gabrielle and yeah, Tracy no, let's DP see. World. See who's see all here. Who's all here today? Who's here? I see Kupakai Art is here with us. Thank you for joining. <laughs> we got Tracy's DP World. Oh. Um, Tracy, have you ever watched Shay's um, lives? Don't just single people out. No, I'm just curious. <laughs> because if you have not watched Shay's lives, you need to go watch her live from two weeks ago. Because she actually talks about the DP world. Um yeah, Lee was there. He knows what I'm talking about. Uh, we have Michelle Hunter, who's having storms and tornadoes. Uh, Gabrielle, who has been following me since the very beginning. I absolutely love all of her comments. Also, she's so awesome. We got Sparkle and Drill, who has been won some stuff. Uh, Robin Dennis Smith, 
No humidity. It's terrible. Yes, you, you, Tracy, you have to go check. I think it was two weeks ago, her live. It may have been three weeks ago. It was either two or three weeks ago. You have to watch that episode. Robin, you remember that live too? Yeah. So if you, if you, anybody saw that live, definitely back me up. Tell Tracy, she's got to go watch it. Got to go watch it. Um, we've got Devil's Angel Madness. Good morning. I say good morning no matter what time it is. Um, my nuts. <laughs> we got Michelle. We got Lee. We have Shell. I don't know if she was saying, hey, pretty lady to me, or if she was saying, hey, pretty lady to dear helper. It might have been for me, but I haven't been on the camera, so yeah. it's not me. We got Melanie, Carol K. Kayleen. Hi, Kayleen. Tammy Hyler is here. Tammy. Hi, I think Tammy. you got Shell Anderson, whoever that is. Yeah, I got her good. <laughs> yeah. She is. She. I, I actually really, really like her. She is funny. She is definitely funny. Um, so, yeah, we've been doing all that. We are almost done. And just for anybody, oh. if you guys watch, huh, if anybody likes to watch that stuff, we have actually been filming our remodel of my craft room, and we are going to be posting the whole entire... Uh, we're doing time lapse. We're doing time lapse, yeah, but we have recorded 90% of what we've been doing, yeah. so you can actually watch me turn my craft room from super drab to super fab. Yeah, nice. But yeah, if it was recorded, like just straight up recording, all you'd see is me slowly taping and taping. swearing the entire time. Yeah, taping stuff off and painting and, and all kinds of junk. But you could have seen uh, Ditsy rip out the carpet. That was probably cool, but I was at work when she did that. Yeah. Uh, yeah. So basically he does the painting. I'm not even allowed in the room while he paints. No, because I'm always tempted to just put a little here or there, and he's like, "Oh, you don't help. Stop helping me." Yeah. Um, and then when it comes to the floors, that's my area of expertise. Up, oh, Sharon Rodriguez is Sharon, here. We actually built a whole entire apartment once yep. when all of our kids lived here. We built a one-bedroom apartment with a bathroom, a working bathroom, a kitchen, <laughs> it worked, everything. <laughs> yeah, and a kitchenette. In a living room. This couch is not comfortable. It is we, not. It was like a lot of money. And we bought it when we first bought the house a couple years back. Because the couch we had was so tiny compared to our last living room. Yeah, and it's all electric. All recliners. There's one, two, four different recliners. Electric recliners. And it is the most uncomfortable couch. We're thinking about putting it up on like our local Craigslist to get rid of it. To buy something cheap small, and like cheaper. Like comfortable. Yeah, like more comfortable. I mean, it's comfortable. Don't get me wrong. It's got lots of storage. And I love like the plugins and stuff underneath the little cup holders section but other than that no i i i can't fall asleep on it it just no. it's not comfortable we ha before we had like these 1970s couches and they weren't from 1970s but they were lazy they, boys they were lazy boys and they look like this half moon um and they, they were big old butt bottoms on them. oh they had like these big old bottoms like yes i am only five foot one but i could stretch it was almost like a bed i could stretch my legs out and only my ankles and feet would be hanging off the side it was amazing i loved it yeah i mean so, it don't, yeah it is comfortable it, don't get me wrong it's just not as comfortable as some of the other couches we've we've definitely seen yeah and sat on uh, oh and then um so I had my clumsy moment, of course, because we're trying to keep the dogs out of the craft room while we're doing the remodel. And I'm five foot one, and we have this big dog gate, um, and we put it up in front of the door because we took the door off and repainted it and stuff. Um, I'm trying to walk over it, and it's like half as tall as me. Yeah, exactly, Tracy. We did that with a bed once too. It was comfortable in the store, but they were really cool about it and let us swap it out. Um, so I'm trying to step over the gate and we have this weird like K-shaped hallway and I'm wearing slippers and they're just a slip on slippers and I trip over the gate and I throw out my right hand 
to catch myself, but because of this K shape, it lands on like a corner of the hallway. My slippers like slide sideways and come halfway off my feet, throwing me off balance. So I throw out my left hand, bounced off of the other wallway, hallway, and then my slippers came completely off of my feet, dumping me onto the floor. Yeah, and she like hurt her wrist. She just, she doesn't fall gracefully. I don't. I have a bruise on my arm. I have a bruise on my leg. And both of my wrists still hurt. It was, yeah. It was special. Yep. Only you. Yes. Only you. <laughs> nice. So... <clears throat> We have got some amazing giveaways to do. Now, normally, like as soon as I get off, um, Lenora, is she does she is she like that? Does she try to catch herself and just like make it a million times worse by just ping ponging like all over Dude, trying seriously. not to actually hit the ground? Dips was falling once in the hallway in our old house. She reached out to catch herself, but opened the door to the side bedroom, fell inside there, and then landed inside of one of the kids' toy boxes. It was crazy. I don't even understand how that can happen from just a simple, like, slip in the hallway. I caught myself on the door handle, and the door handle just opened. <laughs> just went through the door. After, yeah. Sorry oh, about yeah, my little bet. guy. He's really old, guys, and he has heart. He's in heart failure. So that hack is from that. That's talent. Yes, Tracy, thank you. I'm talented. Yeah. <laughs> talent. Yeah. So usually, like I was saying, Thursdays, as soon as I'm done here, I start um, shipping out your guys' prizes. So this week is a little bit crazy because I have all of my stuff and all of our tools. Hi, Jay Lee. Hi, Jay Lee. Lee. <laughs> and... <laughs> So my house is just stuffed full of stuff. She face plate planted outside of a Walgreens. Ouch. Ouch. I did not face plant, but somehow I twisted around in circles and fell in front of a pet store once. My daughter laughed so hard. So <laughs> I usually Get everybody's packages ready Thursday night, and Dear Helper drops them off on the post on Fridays. So I can't find anything right now. Like, I have everything, but everything is just kind of a pain in the butt. So this particular week, the winners are not going to get their stuff quite as quickly. Um, I am going to get everything packaged on Friday and hopefully be able to get them out to the mailbox on Monday, but we're gonna have to see because Dear Helper actually has to go out of town. And it is, he's going to the coast, so it's about three hour drive away from here. So he's gonna have three, to leave three and a half at like five traffic. o'clock in the morning. Six. Six? Yeah, I gotta be there by like 9 30. Okay. He is a poor puppy. He's on so many medications too. But he's my baby and I love him. Hi, Shana. He's my baby. All right, so do we want to see who won? No, they didn't come here for that. You guys don't want to see who won? No. Oh, speaking of which, as we're moving over to the TV, hey, if any of y'all get bored this week, I am only 109 hours away from reaching my first level of monetization. And I also have my Buy Me A Coffee and my Patreon that I started you know, if you want to help out with me buying all the small shop stuff and being able to do these amazing giveaways. And I think there's a Dear Helper special on Patreon. I don't really know what I do. Maybe I just stand there or maybe you watch me mow the yard or clean the pool or vacuum. I, I don't know. Do the dishes. He's going to do the Mandarin <laughs> dance from Final Fantasy 14 while yelling Koopa Kai the whole time. Yeah, so if you don't know what that dance is, oh, you have crats, to look it up. nuts. Yeah. So yeah, I, I do the <laughs> stupid dance in the pool when we're playing volleyball. Whenever I win off of Final Fantasy fourteen online. Do you, do you guys? Do you want to show? No, the I'm dance? not doing it. I'm not doing it right now. <laughs> nice. 
today's show. All right, so let's roll over to, because I'm in here. So we're on the big TV. You guys might be able to actually see it a Maybe. little bit better. We'll see, we'll see how much reflection is Almost. In congrats, Tracy. Almost. I'm getting so close. I'm so excited. You guys might be able to see this TV a little bit better. Maybe. It's mostly just me zooming like an idiot. There we go. Ow, my finger's stuck. You out there? I'm good enough. Do you find it? Yeah, we're on it. Good enough. It's good enough for government work. If there's any are government you workers. Stuff? Things you know, are moving. Saying. Okay. Can you guys see that TV better? A little bit, probably, but you need to get off of that and go to the winners. Or we're going to announce them, I Thank guess. He's so bossy. He's so bossy, guys. Just do your job. All right. What did we talk about? Dude, listen to him. And you know what we talked about today in therapy? Is that sometimes he bullies me. I don't bully her. The therapist said you bully me sometimes. What does she know? <laughs> See, he's bossy. No. I'm just playing most of the time. I'm just playing. Oh, mutt nuts. Why, why'd you run that up? What number is mutt nuts? How did you hack? How did you hack me? Is she Didn't you one? just win last week also? You didn't even say anything. You were just, boom, there's Mutt Nuts. I know. I think she hacked me. All right. So that's, so Mutt Nuts Crazy Crafting has got first run. My cat Zoe is so cute. When she wants me to love on her, she will come and headbutt my hand and meow, telling me to stop what I am doing and give her the attention. <laughs> my little black dog, O, that was laying next to me a little bit ago does that. Did you already write down oh, their names so we know who's first? I got, I got it. I got oh. it right here. Nice. All right. So, Mutt Nuts. I'm on it, baby. Who's All right. One. Who's next? Oh, and in case you guys haven't went and looked at it, Mutt Nuts does have a YouTube channel if you guys want to check her out. Yes, definitely. And yeah. next up is Sharon Rodriguez, and I believe she is also here. I think my fox squishy pin is so cute. My only novelty diamond painting pin. And yes, I believe we saw a picture of that. It's like yeah. an orange. Yeah, it's like a little orange fox. fox. Yeah. yeah, and she posted it on the Facebook page if you guys want to see. It is very cute. Boss kitty. Yeah. All right, so that is number two. And I like her hat. Who is number three? Sarah M. Gandhi. Sarah in here? I don't remember seeing a Sarah name. I did not see it. Why does this camera keep doing that? I don't know. What are you doing? It just does it itself. It's like trying to focus, but it can't. There we go. Okay. Your kit is so cute. I cannot wait to see you bring the palm with glasses to Color for Life. I can't either. You need to finish my crafting room so I can get my dumb painting on, on. I'm working on it. Okay, who is next? Kathy K, 4176. In Toronto, there is a lot of, what if that be Canadian geese? Canada geese? Yeah, either in way. In the area. But when I get to see the baby geese following their parents, they are so cute. All baby animals are cute. Yes. Even the bald ones. Yep. I don't know what number we're on anymore, so next winner. Oh, I forgot to write down the names. Way to go, Sharon Rodriguez. What? I get so excited about, I just love to give presents. Sarah. Speaking of which, Shell, did you get that little present I sent you? Kathy K4176. And Melanie, Melanie is wins here. Again too. Winning all of the prizes. It yeah. says, always enjoy your lives. Your canvas is super cute. Love seeing it in the background. Aw, thank you, Melanie. Except for this this week, it's not in the background because nope. When she said that, it made me think maybe I'm a cat and I have nine lives. Maybe, maybe not. All right, who's next? Judy Weaver. Judy and Weaver. This is a family member of ours. Yeah. And Judy writes, my 14-year-old dog, Bubbles, is so cute. He is cute. He is. Yeah, 
is. So that was actually my auntie. Yes, it is. What is next? TX Laura. She has also won before. We got some repeat winners in here. Repeat winners or repeat cheaters. Now, that's one of the things that I do like is that this is a new event, and we have had a fantastic turnout for this being our very first event, but it is still kind of small enough to where the odds are a lot lower for yeah, everybody to win. Yeah, the odds are forever in your favor? Yeah. Or something like that? I don't even know. So, TX Laura says, you two are so cute together, and I love how you support each other. Dear helper, you are much appreciated. Aw, somebody likes me. Not me. Nope. Not me. Definitely not it's you. Not, uh -uh. No, I love you. <laughs> <laughs> All right, next winner. All right. Little Angel 764. My cats are cute, but all animals are cute. That is absolutely true. And just because Little Angel wrote it twice did not up her odds of winning. Yeah. Congratulations, Lil and I And I tested this. I typed in cute, 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 and it didn't didn't make me win. Aw, uh, thanks, Tracy. I am having so much fun. They were actually in one of Shay's channels. They were talking about um doing like a uh like a convention or a retreat. Not, yeah, like a get together yeah. of uh, content creators. Yeah. I and mean, they've already done it. No, it's not content oh, no? creators. It's for anybody that wants to diamond paint and oh. meet some of their friends online. And I live in Southern Oregon. So we're um, two hours away from the ocean. We've got camping, fishing, river rafting, jet boats, oh. uh, Shakespearean theater. We've got skiing. Mm. Yeah. I mean, snowmobiling, just hiking, an hour ahead waterfalls, of us. I, waterfalls. And we've also got like a ton of wineries. I live in wine country. And I was thinking, I should look into doing a West Coast retreat over here. Yeah, I think it would be amazing because this is such, I live in a vacation um, county already. Yeah. Yeah. So the next winner is Marie. Marie Jose Hamill. Simply all babies are cute, isn't it? I ain't even going to lie, okay? I think all animal babies are cute, but my daughter, the first 20 minutes after she was born, she looked like a troll. She did. It, cutest troll ever. Most adorable troll ever. But my kids came out looking purple. And then they put little purple hats on them. And for the first 20 minutes of their life, they look like little baby trolls. Cute. Uh, uh, I don't know what number we're on. Is this is this the last one? Do we have another one? That's the last one. That is. That's number nine. All right, I'm going to bring Let's it back to you. She did. I will show pictures. There's they put a little purple light. hat on her, and she's already, like, purple and blue-skinned and all kinds of wrinkly, you know? And it was like, oh, that's what I called her. I called her my little baby, my, my little troll baby. Like, her whole entire life growing up, I would call her my little troll baby. That is so cute. So, dear helper is over there holding out his arms, thinking that Ollie's going to come to him. I just want him to come over here. Come here, buddy. I'll paint you. <laughs> paint your face. He does this all day because Ollie is 100% my dog, and he is always <laughs> like, oh, come love me. <laughs> Finally, thank you, Lee. You were not the only one. Awesome. Yes, bleach white with a cone on your head. I am very sorry, but when babies very first are born, like right there, not the cutest things in the world. We still have to let them know what they want, baby. Well, go ahead. Go put it back on the TV, my lovey. Oh, yeah. We got to do the spinny roller thing. Yeah, spinny roller. Or spinny, spinny, spinny thing. I don't know what it's called. The winner thing. Yeah. And need I remind who here has watched um, Final Destination 1? Everybody. Mm hmm. Everybody. Now you can see all the apps and the, the games she plays. Come on, TV. I don't have this very straight, do I? No. Nope. <laughs> nope. Yes, congratulations to all the winners. 
Okay, oh, Six I'm gonna is coming. zoom in a little more. Uh-oh. Nice. Yeah, I was looking up places to do retreats, and there are a couple people where between camping and cabins and stuff like that, you can fit like up to 100 people. So Yes, yeah, prize will. Thank you, Melanie. Thank you. Yes. All right, who's number one? All right. Who number one? Mutt. Mutt nuts. Mutt, mutt nuts is one number one. I don't know one. why. I always want to say mutt nuts is crazy, but it's mutt nuts crazy crafting. I don't know. This is we don't it. know. Oh. All right. So, mutt, what did you win last time? This week you've won a ten dollar gift certificate to Black Dahlia's Putty. <laughs> what? That was nice. English. That Good was total enough. words, guys. Good enough. All right. So there we go. So Mutt Nuts gets some Black Dahlia. Not Dream Wax. Oh, she won Dream Wax, so she's still won. Oh, awesome. So now you got wax and your petty. Yeah, You're good. Perfect. Words are hard. Oh, my goodness. You know they are. Who's next? Who's next? Well, you know who's Sharon? next. Sharon? What they, Sharon is here. Sharon, you want a $50 Diamond Art Club gift card. What Very did you nice. win last time? Sharon won before. I feel like Sharon has won before. Yeah, I don't remember. I think so. Maybe not. Maybe. Um, maybe yes. Not. She says yes. But she didn't say what she won last Which, time. Oh, I think it was a pin. Maybe it was a I cool think last pin. time Sharon won a pin. So you won the $50 Diamond Art Club gift card. Aw, thanks, Tracy. Thanks, Koopa Kai. Koopa Kai! Well, you want a gift card now. Yeah, then you, now you want a $50 gift card, so you're good. And Sarah has won some Dream Wax. So I'm going to have to check, Sarah, because um, Dream Wax Studios is only actually able to send to the U.S. and Canada. So if you're in the U.S. or Canada, you are good to go. If you are not, I will reach out to you about getting you a gift card to a shop that you would like. Um, if you're international instead of this let's push the button again now who's up kathy k kathy k kathy k has won a puppy now i uh yellow dog designs yeah same thing well kind of not really not at all no same thing not a bit she won a puppy all right who's next who's next melanie I know what Melanie wants. Last time she won the the gift card. Melanie wants the yellow dog tray. Well, those are gone. It's gone now. It's gone now. Dang, Melanie, you had two tries and you missed it both times. Melanie won some release papers from Crafts with Crashly. There you go. Crafts with Crashly. I know. I'm surprised hey. with how much I say Koopa Kai art. It hasn't popped up Koopa Kai. On, on the thing yet. I haven't won yet. Nobody that has the love of an animal is a loser. True story. Yes. All right. And Auntie Judy, what are you going to win? All I know is I'm going to save myself a little bit of money on shipping. Randa's Craft Corner. And uh, is that one we ship or actually ship? I don't know it might be actually this one we ship but it might oh. be because we live so far out of town it might actually be, be cheaper, cheaper to, to mail it than to drive into town and drop it off <laughs> it's true who's next TX, before you spin it TX, TX Laura Laura the wit pushing the buttons I'm pushing all the buttons and Dun she won 
Yes, a cover minder from Diamond Pen Pals. Diamond Pen Pals. All right, we got two things left. Little Angel. Is Let's Little see. Angel next? She is. Do it. Click on this little button. Lulu's not here, though. Tote bag. Tote bag. And the tote bags, bags are, are cool. Cute. I like them. Of course, I made them. What's that? You didn't okay. make them. Make them I feel like you? last week, Bistro's exclusive was, was also, also the last prize. Who got also. it? Maria Jose. Maria Jose Hamill. Yes. Got the Bistro exclusives pen. And remember, if you see this, which you should see this so you know you won, or maybe you'll just get it and then watch this either way, make sure you post a picture so we know what pin you got and so everybody else can see it too. Yeah, and from Diamond Pen Pal, because Diamond Pen Pals and Bistro Exclusives, everything is different from those, and I don't know what I'm sending. Yes, I'm... We know Koopa Kai. I know you're not complaining. We know it. Yeah. All right. Do you want this back no. on you? Yeah, sure. Or All we right. can turn it on you and you can do the Mandarin dance. No, I can barely walk. <laughs> <laughs> there, turn that back to your little logo thingy. I don't want it. it it's got reflection. Oh, okay. I understand what you're saying. Yeah, um, yeah, yeah. Yeah. Hold on. Where's my photos? there did i fix it fixed okay let me see what you guys were talking about while i was busy not looking see if i missed anything before we sign off for the night here and give them their keyword maybe oh yeah you guys want your keyword for next week also every time that's what they come here for oh is that why you guys are here i thought you guys were here to watch us make fun of each other since that's like how we roll Nah, we don't make fun of each other that's a lie you tell telling fibs. I don't lie. You're a storyteller. I've never told a lie in my life. <laughs> You're a storyteller. <laughs> now that is our love language as making fun of each other. Sorry, I gotta post this again. It's Friday Eve, because it is. <laughs> I just like that. I'm gonna start oh. using that every Thursday. Like, What's oh wrong, my guys? goodness. It's Friday Eve, calm down. Mutts and Nuts is at the halfway point on our canvas. Uh, luck is running off on me and I'm not upset. <laughs> nice. yeah, now gotta... everybody's going to ask Melanie and Mutt Nuts to rub them. Yeah, you guys got to, Internet, yeah. got to put the keyword in. Do it, Shell. Do it. Uh, Hi, Jennifer. Welcome. Sorry you're late. You're not late. <laughs> You're never late. You can you can replay this later. Oh, nice. It's just fun if you want to interact with. Do you know what the Mandarin dance me. is, Melanie? Have I, you seen, I think it's called I, the Mandarin dance. It is. Have you seen it on Final Fantasy XIV? I, I mean, you guys can look it up. I'm not going to bring it up to you, but I can do that dance. He does that dance perfectly. If you have not looked it up, look it up. The Mandarin dance from Final Fantasy XIV. I do it in a swimming pool. He period. embellishes. Yes, he does. No. I am here for your awesomeness. I don't even think I remember to come back and do the keyword last week. You did, Shell. She did? Yeah, you did. I saw it. That's going to be your first putty. Now, remember, you're getting the gift card, so you'll have to go buy the putty. But that means that you get to pick your own flavor. So that's always nice. Yeah, I'm not doing it. I'm especially not doing it on camera. It's one of those things that you just don't show other people. I'll film him in the pool after I've warmed his butt at the volleyball because we love to play volleyball. And we're yeah, we, so competitive. We get so aggressive with yeah, each other. We bought some new um, extensions for the uh, like four foot extensions for the fence to keep the volleyball from flying to the neighbor's yard. Yeah, because we're always knocking our balls into the neighbor's yard. Yeah, I was actually, <laughs> my wedding ring, I hit the ball so hard playing volleyball in the pool that my wedding ring shot off of my finger 
and we had to scour both of our neighbors' yards, and we found it like in the rocks underneath one of our neighbors' trees yep. is where I found my wedding ring. It had flown off my hand. That's how violently we play against each other. Yeah, so Koopa Kai says he thanks for the finality for the final for the event. I should include the dance. I think you should do the dance at some point, baby. I don't know. Even if you don't do it tonight, maybe. I, I, I can't even barely get may, out of the couch. Maybe, maybe that can be the grand prize win for everybody. So we have two grand prize winners, and then we'll do the everybody grand prize, and they can watch the Mandarin dance. Yeah. We'll think about it. I'll think about it. I don't mind. I'm not really that shy. I just, yeah. What do you guys think of that? I just, I'm going to look like a jackass doing it. <laughs> Everybody loves a jackass. <laughs> it's true. <clears throat> um, I'll double check my. Yeah. If, if she needs anything, she'll definitely uh, reach out to you. Uh, oh, yeah. PM or that, anything like that. I will stalk you. See, they all agree. Yes. Grand prize live. You do the Mandarin dance for everybody that didn't get a prize. That way, everybody walks away a winner. Fine, except we, you. If I do that, <laughs> everybody with a husband that doesn't currently diamond paint has to take a picture of their significant other, husband or wife, whatever, diamond painting. And then I will do the Mandarin dance for the opening <laughs> to the finale <laughs> event. It'll be in a gift format, most likely, because I'll pre record it so we don't have to mess around. Yeah, feel free to stalk away. Okay, so, <laughs> babe. What? I don't want to open up my phone and go through. I know what the our keyboard is. Yeah, because. Uh, what is it? Well, and, uh, I don't want people to see our text messages making fun of each other. They might think that we're nuts. No, what are you talking about? I know what it is. Well, share it with me because I you texted it to me earlier, but then I didn't think about the fact that if I open up the text, everybody's going to see us making fun of each other. You can have your cat diamond paint. That is a lie, Melanie. That is a lie. Yeah, there's a dog on Instagram that actually evicted his owner out of the house. Yep, I saw it because she made me see it. Oh. So, I, something to do with something I am not. Oh, uh, where's wait? Where's Lenore singing? Okay. She's getting ready to do her singing. Oh, yeah, because there's a live after mine. All right, yep. give, give me the keyword so we keyword can... Keyword is smart. Yes. Tell me what things make your animals or significant others or anything like that smart. Like, my dog is super smart because if he runs out of water... He will come and tug on us and drag us over to his water bowl. My yeah. little chihuahua will like pull us over to the water bowl and be like, hey, he'll like it, show dummies. it to me. He'll be like, hey, look at this. Look at this. Look at this dear yeah. helper. Fill up my water, man. No, I gotta do it. Yeah. So keyword is smart. Yes. Yes. Or you can tell me why your pet is not smart. Yeah, either or. Yeah, like I have a pet, and somebody was talking about this actually in my Facebook about or no in my discord about how somebody on diamond art club was talking about how they were out cleaning up their dog's leavings and saw something glittering in the sun and it was drills because the dog had been eating all the drills that was my dog that was a little black and white dog that you guys saw here earlier we were out there cleaning up his, his leavings yeah, and he'd he eaten so many drills that yeah it was like sparkling like a vampire in the sun. <laughs> he, <Fly> knows, hard. <laughs> he knows the camera's on him. He's like, come on, dad. There's my know. drill eater. That's the guy. That's why he's not smart. <laughs> yeah, and they're spoiled. The other one is right there. Yeah. Just all comfy. Yeah. All right. All right. So that is all for tonight, guys. Don't forget, if you get bored, please watch a couple of my videos. We're semi-amusing. And we will see you guys all next week. Bye, everybody. Oh, like, subscribe. Yeah. <laughs>